Yeah, um, you know, we played uh, you know, pretty solid um, from start to finish tonight. Obviously, a big goal by Blazer to get us going. Uh, you know, we seem to do pretty well when we get the first one. He's able to get an early one for us. So uh, everyone chipped in tonight, and it was it was nice to get two points. Yeah, how, how important is it that, that first goal? I know Carolina is a team that really comes out quick, and, and you guys have had a little trouble. Yeah, they, they even came out quick. They played hard. They're they a tough team to play against. They're, they're a skating team. They're always in your face. They, they pressure up ice hard. The D are, are pinching walls and, and trying to give you no time and space. So uh, we were able to find rooms, find Find, find holes and find openings. We're able to capitalize on chances. Was that quick pace at the start of the game going into the second period? Was that intentional or certainly part of your plan to balance their game? Yeah, I mean, he, you definitely have to match it, no doubt about it. Um, I think uh, we talked about early on um, not going run and gun with them. They're a good skating team that likes to play off the rush and they have mobile defensemen. So the better we are with the, you know, the grind style heavy type of game, uh, we're able to wear them down and, and get chances and opportunities. This is, is this one of those games where you feel like, and, and Bruce Ruby's talked about it, just getting enough guys and getting traffic going towards the net where a lot of your goals scored in that fashion tonight. And is that something that was kind of been missing here a little bit? Um, you know, I think definitely the first one. You know, uh, I think, you know, it shows if you go to the net and and plays with a great screen, uh, timely screen to, to let the, you know, Morassic not see the puck the, the whole way and get the rebound. If you go to the, you know, to the net and, and you know, time it right, you're going to get rewarded. And he did there. What do you think of... Uh Young uh, Zach Sanford's play is putting together nice stretch. He's he's been uh, he's been really good for us. Um, you know I think you see his game uh, come a long way. He's he's a big guy, strong on pucks. His hands are good, and uh, you know, he's playing with two great players. So he's making making the most of his opportunity. He deserves everything he's getting right now. He's uh, he's playing extremely well for us and has been for a long time. So it's nice to see him get a couple. Can you see his confidence growing at all? Or? Yeah, definitely. I think confidence is everything. No no doubt about it. When uh, you know he, he's a good player and he knows it. But I think once you you get a few points or get some chances and get a good opportunity, your confidence rises. And, and um, you know, I think those two guys that he's playing with help him as well. I think um, O'Reilly is just so easy to play with and, and um, you know, uh, makes players around him better. And and uh, I think Sani's complimenting those guys very well. That's the biggest thing he's more assertive right now? It just seems like it. Yeah, I think, yeah, definitely. Um, you know, skating, he's skating extremely well right now, hard on pucks, uh, winning lots of battles, going to the front of the net. Um, like I said, uh, it's really nice to see him get uh, rewarded with some points and, and goals and, and uh, you know chip in because he's had a great season so far. We talked this morning about when his, skate, when, when his skates are moving, that's when he's at his best. I mean, as a player, is that something you just have to continually remind yourself of just to get yourself going? Yeah, I, th I think the game's so fast now and, and players are so quick and if, you know, myself included or if you're a bigger guy, if you don't move your feet, I think you're going to get yourself in trouble. So um, he's a big guy and, and when he's skating well and moving his feet, he, he's more effective and I think that's what he's doing right now. What made the power play so successful out there tonight? Uh, you know, seen some video before. Uh, you know, Mark Savard made some some uh, some good reads, told us some good things. I think uh, you know Petra made some good plays there, where the, the shot passed over Riley and Schwartz. He was able to, you know, almost uh, you know get it home and, and then uh, the other one I think just guys making plays really good support guys making plays and, and Schwartz he uh, fed me with a nice pass there. Is 20 goals still a pretty good feel good milestone in the NHL for a player? Yeah yeah absolutely I, I think um, you know if you're not Alexander Ovechkin I think it's uh, <laughs> it's uh, it's good for any player so um, you know it's uh, obviously uh, you know, nice to score 20 I, I think uh, compliment goes to um, you know, I've had a lot of linemen this year but Schwartz you we've kind of been together um, you know, throughout the whole thing and, and uh, he's just so he's so easy to play with fun to play with um, you know uh, credit goes a lot to him I guess, you don't, no, no, I guess you don't uh, you don't need that new stick huh I don't have any left. I had three and two were gone. So, well, yeah, guys, people keep taking them, so I have one. So I'm not using them.